Okay, here it is where it all began, the United States of America. The Boston Tea Party was here in Boston, Massachusetts, where a group of disgruntled colonists dumped tea into Boston Harbor. That's right. So, the question becomes, why is this even important? Well, years before, George Washington and others were toasting the king. And then all of a sudden, they decided not to like the king. Why? Because they stepped on their interests. This is extremely important for international politics, political violence, revolution, etc. Because once you begin to step on the interests of powerful people, that is a theory of alienation, you begin to alienate powerful people and you lose your base. This is what happens when people get overthrown. So the king, that is, the UK, was overthrown in the United States, of, which is now the United States of America. But this is also fungible, applicable to other areas. Samosa was overthrown in Nicaragua in 1979 because he began to step on other people's interests. The same with Batista of Cuba. Obviously diem of vietnam and others so it's a common theme in international politics that people get overthrown kings queens etc for stepping on not only the peasantry's interests but the interests of very powerful people who don't want to be taxed etc so when we start looking at it this is a theory of alienation in which countries begin to have revolutions and guerrilla wars, etc., when they begin to lose broad-based support attributable to the fact that they step on other people's interests. So you got to watch out as a leader whose interests you step on. So this is very interesting and a very interesting quick video where there's a little museum and everything here dedicated to this Boston Tea Party and the beginning of the United States of America. But the Tea Party itself is actually applicable to understand world politics today. We have revolutions all over the world from the Middle East, Latin America, Asia because governments fail to provide public goods that is, benefits to the people, and when you st start stepping on the interests of certain people, particularly powerful people, it builds a broad-based movement that then overthrows you. So watch out when you're leading a country and a nation, because if you step on powerful people, interest, You'll be like the UK, kicked out, and then with the creation of the best country in the world, the United States. Yay! So, here it is. They're really trying to sell you a lot of stuff. You know, they're trying to really milk it for the money here. But, of course, I don't pay. Look at Even the ATM machine has a Boston Tea Party on it. <laughs> well, everyone, take care. And have a great day. And don't forget, the Boston Tea Party has a lot to do with international relations in our present day form.